What's up YouTube? Thanks for tuning in to another Bald Mike Does Life video. Uh, today I am going to be doing a review of a little device that I purchased. <clears throat> oh, it's been a, probably last spring or something like that. It's called the Check Go. Um, you can pick this up on perfectball.com. They have a newer one called the Check Go Pro, which it is actually around $42 or something like that. I got this one a year ago, which the price has now gone up about eight or $9. I got this for around 17 bucks. So now they're asking, I think it's almost $27 now. So it's gone up about eight, you know, like eight to $10 or something like that. <clears throat> but um, this thing, since I've been using it, this is for your putting. What it does is it, it finds the perfect access of that golf ball because some balls won't be perfectly made. So when you hit a putt, it could just w go offline. So what this does, this finds the perfect center point, balance point of that golf ball. So you aim it at where your line is. So you want to aim it right at the hole or wherever, or maybe a little left, a little right. And then you just give it a nice roll straight back, straight through. And I'm telling you now, the putting will change. This this actually device does work. I highly recommend getting yourself one, um, especially for under 30 bucks. You'll be extremely happy that you did. So it comes with this little cage, um, takes two AA batteries, and it comes with this little marker here. So what I'm gonna be doing, this is a brand spanking new Pro V1X, Titleist number two here, Pro V1X left dash. Hopefully you guys can see that. Pro V1X, put it the correct way. Left dash. So what happens, most people, they line up their golf ball with this line. Your weight could be over here. So you could be hitting that putt, going right at the hole, and then the wobble of that golf ball just moves it off line. So I'm going to show you how different it really truly is on even the best golf ball on the planet how far off this is gonna be. I've only seen a couple that come up kinda of close, but most of these things are way off. So all you gotta do is put it in there, just like that, hit the little deal here, and then I'm gonna set it flat, and then you just kinda of let it spin for about 20 seconds. You just hold the button down, let me get the marker ready. <clears throat> you just kinda of hold the button down. See how wobbly that golf ball already is? Wow, this ball is kind of far off. Wow. But uh, just hold the button down, you know, give or take about 20 seconds or something like that. And you can, once you get one of these, you'll see it trying to get to that main core, balance point, whatever you want to call it get all that weight distributed correctly. <clears throat> and see this, this golf ball must be kind of bad because it's wobbling still, these higher RPMs. This golf ball's not wanting to behave and it's a left dash. Look at that, hear it? It shouldn't do that. So it's having a hard time finding that perfect balance point for this particular golf ball. All right, let me see if I can get a mark on here before it jumps out of the cage again. All right. <clears throat> so you just take your little pin in there. There's a hole right there that you stick your little pin thing in there. Let this thing kind of die down. Now, this one's actually not too far off. So you can see this is where you would line up your ball to the hole. And you can see the line here, if you lined it up there on the Pro V1 part, your ball would actually wobble offline. So this ball is actually not that bad, as far as bad as I thought it was going to be. So when I tee off with this ball, <clears throat> I put it on my tee, aim it right at the target. When I'm putting with it, you know, I aim that, that line right at that hole. So if you were to aim it up here, with your Pro V1X line. So here it is, the ball's actually this way. So this ball would veer off to the right. You could hit a perfect putt and still miss the dang thing. <clears throat> but anyway, guys, I do highly recommend this little device. Um, 
for 27 bucks, I, it's gonna help your putting. It really will. It, it gives me confidence. That's a good line on the ball to line it up. Uh, let me know if you guys own one of these. Has it helped your putting out? Do you recommend it? Uh, thanks for tuning in, guys. Make sure to hit that like and su su subscribe button. Have a great weekend and God bless.